Hey guys, welcome back. We're here with Hayden Grook. She is the program coordinator for uh, Washington Children's Shelter. And you're here to talk about uh, Bike for Shelter. Yes, thanks. Your annual fundraiser uh, and also uh, basically a celebration of everything Washington Children's Shelter, right? That does, yeah. This event is super important. It is a fundraiser for the shelter, but it's also uh, just an opportunity for us to get the community together and um, everybody with their families and do something fun. So, yeah. Nice. So what's different about this year? Oh my gosh, this year there's going to be quite a few different things. Um, probably the biggest is that this is the first time that we're offering it as a free event. Um, and that wouldn't have been possible without over 50 sponsors that we have this year. Yeah. And um, one of your sponsors, Montana Railing, yes. has been sponsoring you guys for pretty much ever. From the beginning, they've been our premier uh, Big Wheeler sponsor. And they also uh, host um, and organize the entire barbecue at the event. So make sure you stop. Um, that's free as well. Everything for the entire event is free, including the barbecue and MRL organizes all the volunteers for it and they cook and serve and everything the entire time they're there as well. Awesome. Yeah. And you, um, you have mini carnival games yeah. and mini uh, things happening there. And of course, the big bike ride is kind of like the staple of yep. Bike for Shelter. That's the thing that starts off the entire event. So you can come, you can do the 10 mile bike ride if that's your speed or if you're more comfortable, there's a two mile loop as well um, that often the little kids do, but adults can certainly do it as well. And you've um, been host, and this has been hosted at uh, Community Medical Center. Yep. Uh, kind of like that uh, large kind of patch of land that they have just adjacent to the, the building. The lawn just in front of Community Medical Center, yeah, and also in front of one of our two buildings, nice. our house at Fort Missoula. Oh, yeah. yeah, it's right in front of that shelter. So. Nice. Yeah. So um, Washington Children's Shelter has been around for many, many years. And it was started by uh, um, Janice Watson, Janice was our Watson. founder 42 years ago. Wow. Yes, yep. Um, are you guys doing any kind of, um, so Bike for Shelter, how long has it been going on for? 19 years. 19 so years. next year will be our 20th year. Nice. And, and the really cool thing is, like, you, since you have so much support from the community and fundraising and it's free yeah and this is like the first year it's ever been free yep so what were some of the costs that were uh, the last couple of years oh it's always just um gosh i mean actually like cost for the event so this is a fundraiser for the shelter and primarily we get that through sponsorship so some of the costs are just carnival games uh, food for the barbecue mm -hmm. this year it's exciting to know that a lot of that was donated as well um and so yeah, I mean, it's not um, a huge expense, but there certainly are some costs of that course. come along with it. The shirts that we like to give everybody for the event. Um, again, some of the, the vendors that come through, um, just things like that. Nice. Yeah. So, yeah, you just, you know, offset a lot of costs <clears throat> and stuff like that. But, of course, there's always a goal. Yes. What is your guys' goal uh, for this? So, about $60,000. It's about 10% of our fundraising budget every uh -huh. year. And um, so, this is the goal for the event. Nice. Yes. Yep. And you guys do pretty well most of the time? Every year we've hit that goal. So fingers crossed we do again. I think that it's going to be, I don't think that it's going to be an issue this year. Um, everything is on track. Like I said, we primarily get um, the, the money that we get comes through sponsorship so we, so we know ahead of time nice. kind of what, what to expect. So let's tell uh, the folks who at home how they can register. So I yeah. brought up their website. You go to Washington Children's Shelter. Yeah, thank you. So if you go to special events um, or even just click that big banner once, once you get on the website. Yeah, and then you'll take you to our website, and you can sign up right there. Um, and this just kind of gives us an idea of if you're coming to the event. Um, but if you're not sure, because there are so many cool things going on in Missoula, um, we are doing registration the morning of the event on May 11th, starting at 8 a.m. Nice. So you can come and sign up and register um, pretty much um, until the first bike ride, or even 11 o'clock is when registration closes. But if you want to bike, get there before cool. 9, I would and say. And of course, you know, um, it happens pretty much um, from about 9, 10 a.m. So registration opens at 8, um, and then 8 till about 1 o'clock. Our events are happening the entire day. A bike rodeo, carnival games, the barbecue, both bike rides, um, live DJ, everything like that is going to be happening that entire time. Nice. Yeah. Cool. Is there anything else you wanted to say? Because um, it's pretty straightforward. This has been going on for 19 years. Yeah, just um, check out our website, watsonchildrenshelter.org, and it'll have all the, hopefully it'll answer all the questions that you may have. And if you don't, feel free to reach out to me, um, and I can answer anything for you. Awesome. Cool. Well, thanks, Hayden. Yeah, thanks really for having us. It. Me. Thanks for having me. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, you, you know, you're with Washington Children's <laughs> yeah, Shelter, so you. us. <laughs>